Hello, welcome to another video in my section on the Mental Health Act. I'm Dr Beth Colby, a psychiatrist in London. Today I'm going to be talking about Section 4. So what is Section 4 of the Mental Health Act? Well, it's an emergency application for detention in hospital for up to 72 hours, that's three days. And it differs from a Section 2 in that only one medical recommendation is required. This is because waiting for a second doctor to come and assess the patient would cause undesirable delay and the patient needs to get to hospital urgently. The medical recommendation is normally completed by a doctor that the patient already knows, such as the patient's GP or psychiatrist. Otherwise, the doctor should be a Section 12 approved doctor. The application for admission is usually by the AMP, the approved mental health practitioner, although rarely it is the patient's nearest relative. The patient needs to meet the criteria for detention in hospital under a section two, which is that they are suffering from a mental disorder, and that mental disorder is a nature or degree that warrants detention in hospital for their own health, safety or safety of others. That means they're mentally unwell, they need to go to hospital even against their wishes because they're very unwell or they may be a danger to themselves or others. Once the medical recommendation has been done, the AMP will do their application and the patient can be taken to hospital so that they're safe whilst awaiting the second doctor to come and do their assessment of the patient. Once the doctor has assessed the patient, one of three things may happen. One is that the doctor feels that they do meet the criteria for detention under the Mental Health Act and they will do an application for either a Section 2, which is for assessment up to 28 days, or for a Section 3, a treatment section, for up to six months. Then the patient will automatically come off their Section 4. If the doctor feels that they do not meet the criteria for detention in hospital, but nevertheless the patient wishes to remain in hospital, they can come off their section four and remain as an informal voluntary patient. Thirdly, if in the doctor's opinion the patient does not meet the criteria for detention in hospital and the patient does not wish to be in hospital, then they come off their section four and the patient is discharged from hospital. Whilst on a section four, a patient can refuse medication. However, if the patient doesn't have the capacity to consent to medication and it is felt it is necessary to give it to them in their best interests, this can be done. Thank you for listening. Bye for now.